Okay, so today I'm going to be pulling the compressor housing off of my car so I can weld the lip on it so my charge pipe stops popping off. Uh, first things first, engine cover and air inlet pipe and then we'll go from there, see where else we need to get off to be able to have enough room to get down there. Alright, so that turned into a lot more than I wanted it to be. I ended up having to pull the turbo uh, right out of the car to get at the last couple bolts on the compressor housing. Oh, and then I ended up taking the turbo apart because it's leaking where the center section meets the um, exhaust housing. I'll give you a look at what all that looks like in a second here. These flies are bugging the shit out of me. There's uh, everything out. Down pipe. And taking that unfold, a bunch of parts on the floor. Here's the exhaust housing, and this has only been on the car for a couple thousand kilometers, and she's yeah, it's not that thick. That's pretty good. <coughs> There's the center section. I'll take it apart. and free but here's the actual problem I'm having is when I this is uh, Twenty fifty six V turbo off a uh, three liter Mercedes diesel or Jeep diesel, and on factory on those, the outlet pipe <coughs> slips over with the O ring and then bolts down so it can't come off. But in order for me to slip on my coupler, I had to grind down the lip a little bit so that I had a flat surface to clamp to. Well, when I ground it down, I didn't make it 100% flat. <laughs> so that uh, likes to pop off all the time under 30-ish pounds of boost. So I'm going to take this out to my welder fabricator guy, and he's going to weld a bead around the outside edge, just like it should have anyways, given how it is. <laughs> Uh, so that that no longer comes off and after that <coughs> We should be good to go and put it all back together There's part number again if anybody wants to bear it, have a look at it uh, Yeah So uh, We'll come back once she's running and all that there's a few other modifications. I'm going to be doing while I have it all apart <coughs> Just downtime with the tune and stuff um, yeah, there's a few other modifications I'm going to be doing while I have it well, on some downtime. Be uh, changing some things with the tune and uh, potentially some injectors coming, just deciding which injectors to get. Um, but we'll see. Anyways, uh, that's all for today. Take care.